record this bad boy. Hi everybody, my name is Gail Zintek. You're joining me today is January 15th, 2020. And uh, my first webinar, Teaching Realtors How to Use Send Out Cards. I have two amazing realtors <laughs> that are with me today. I have Farah LePan. Farah lives in Georgia. Farah, introduce yourself. How long have you been a realtor? And how long have you been using Send Out Cards? Well, so I've been a realtor since 2013. So I'm coming up on seven years. Um, yep, I'm in Augusta, Georgia. I have three, three littles, little kiddos, um, and I started using send out cards in 2017. I watched Gail, I watched you for a long time, <laughs> and just one day I said, you know what, that's enough, and I just messaged, I messaged you and said, hey, I need to get in to send out cards. How do I do this? So that was a, um, that was really great. So, and we're going to get into this along the way, but tell me what subscription are you on? I am on the 97, the yeah. unlimited. Okay, so you're 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 sending a lot of heartfelt cards. Yes, um, probably not as many as I want to, and I I'm definitely getting better over time at sending them when I think about them, when I when I have that prompting. So, and that's why I'm on the unlimited, so that I don't really have to think about about it. <laughs> isn't, isn't so you make a valid point when you're on the unlimited. It doesn't matter if you send 50 cards or 150 cards. It's one price. And we're going to talk about that towards the end. I want you to, I want you all that are watching this to get a feel for what send out cards is. We want to inspire you on how it can add value to your personal life and your business. And so I'm going to ask Anne to introduce herself. I've known Ann for a long time in many, many different realms within the <laughs> real estate community but and tell tell our audience who you are and what you love about send out cards <laughs> well i'm an addict um <laughs> i don't want to be a recovering addict i <laughs> i'm addicted um i am ann lacoste i live up here in beautiful delton michigan almost to grand rapids michigan and um in my own little bliss spot on a cute little lake and i have two grown children a ton of bonus children and uh, three beautiful grandchildren and I'm a puppy mom <laughs> so my life is revolving around puppy training and uh, thankfully my husband is taking care of most of her skills um, and it's going well and I have been in the real estate world for over 10 years in title um, in marketing and sales in the title world and then finally just dove into real estate this past year and so it's um, what I'm lovingly calling my encore job. Um, but it's not my main thing. My other thing, my addiction is send out cards. And um, I've been doing send out cards for almost three years. Gail has introduced me to send out cards many times. And for whatever reason, I just didn't jump in. And then when I jumped in, the swimming's fine. So <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I'm on the 97 plan, the unlimited. Um, I am an affiliate. Um, I love sharing my addiction with whomever will listen to me talk about it. And, um, and my love of graphic arts and my own personal artwork is something that I can pour into send out cards too. So it's been fun. Awesome. Well, we're going to talk a little bit. Um, we're going to get into the system now and I'm going to share with you. I've got examples. So I want you, many of you are new and you thought, well, what is it? Is it, is it greeting cards? Is it postcards? And it's, it's a lot. It's all the above. So I have samples here. So this is a postcard with send out cards. You can create a postcard. This is when, you know, have you ever gone to the, in, we were in Sedona and I created my own postcard that I sent to a group of people. So this is the four by six versus a five by seven. And my light's a little bright. So here's an example of a flat card. This is my beautiful granddaughter, McKenna, and she created these graduation and, and well, basically open house announcements, front and back, they go in an envelope, so five by seven. These are also really great. If, if you see um, somebody post a picture and you can send them a flat card, perfect for framing, okay? 
And then we have, we have our two panel cards. So this is an example of a two panel card able to create whatever it is. This is actually a campaign. So I'm also going to educate you on heartfelt cards. Farah and Anne are both on the unlimited system, system as well as my, the subscription. And then there's campaign cards. And today I'm going to share with you how I, I, I'm going to show you live how I'm going to send one card I created for our top 100 that's going to go out to 183 people with the click of a button. And we're going to talk branding today. So this is an example of a two panel. Then there's the wonderful three panel card. So all of these cards that I've showed you right now are included in the unlimited plan. So you can create an, an amazing, this is a, a, our BNI group. So we had a holiday party. What does Gail do? She goes places and she takes lots of pictures and then we celebrate people. So this is an example of a three panel card that went out to our BNI group. And then there's these amazing great big cards. <laughs> so this was a, a beautiful card I keep on my desk. And although I'm going to share with you something, as you see, there's pictures of me. So much hats so much love and this is a picture on the back and see this isn't even signed but guess what i know who this is from because why do you think i know who it's from it's from my friend alicia crastle who sent this card to me and she didn't sign it she didn't brand it but it touched my heart in such a way because those are two of my beautiful grandchildren that i'm on the front of the card with so this sits on my desk how many of you are sending cards that remain after after time that sits on people's desks long after the sentiment that you had the feeling that you had and we were talking about promptings Farrah talked about promptings when you have a prompting what's a prompting a prompting is when someone comes to mind and they don't leave your mind they stay top of mind and so you have a responsibility to pause in your day and to act on that prompting now, it could be a text message. It could be a phone call. It could be a Facebook messenger. Maybe even a Snapchat. I'm gonna share a Snapchat story with you that's amazing. Um, and, or it could be, you just pause. You go into your, your send out card system and you send a card. So I'm gonna share my screen with you and I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go in and share my um, desktop and we're gonna get into the system. So this is send out cards. When you log into your system, you have, and if, you're, if you are on the, a subscription plan, anywhere from 17, 37, 97, you will have this button called relationships. This is the relationship manager. This is what, for the past 13 years, almost, it'll be 13 years in May, 12 and a half years, I've added people to my relationship manager. And you see, I have 6,853 people in my contact manager within send out cards. I can go up to any one of them and look at the card history. I'm gonna pick on Kristen. There's Kristen's, um, she received a holiday card. We'll go back to contacts. I can go into any person that I've ever sent cards to and look at Jackie. I'll go to Jackie Adams. Jackie's received a few cards from me over the, over the years. And so what's really cool about that is the ability to go back and look at the cards that you send. Campaigns. We're going to talk campaigns today. Um, this is my five card buyer campaign that I have that goes out immediately, three months, 12 months, May and November. You can see there's three little gifts attached that go out along with those throughout the year. Um, my campaigns, you can see that we've got lots of different campaigns, client events, um, Thanksgiving for family and friends, Thanksgiving for a farm area, back to school, a five touch campaign for new send out cards customers. And this is the one I'm going to show you a little bit later, my January 2020 top 150. I just created this card this morning. You guys motivated me, inspired me because I like to show you what I do on a daily, weekly, monthly, yearly basis. The card catalog. Now there's thousands of cards within the card catalog. 
you can click on photo drop. I love photo drop cards because they make my pictures look really great. <laughs> they are templated and then all I have to do is you know, click on it and add a picture. So if I want to send the belief card, I can change the color based on the cards that are in here. I can customize. I can create a flat card, a two panel, a three panel, a great big card a postcard. I can use standard paper. 99% of my cards go out standard paper. If I want to up, if I have like a really special picture or something that I want to add satin or pearl paper, then I can do that as well. Um, so that's the card catalog. You have the ability to create, um, you know, cards from the card catalog. Like I say, there's there's thousands of cards to choose from in all different categories. Thank you, birthday, holiday, keeping in touch, sympathy, get well, um, and then gifts. I'm gonna share the gifting. The, the gifting ideas, and this is where my Snapchat story comes in. Okay, um, yesterday I was on, I, I just, I have the app and I was looking and I saw that, you know, a past client, I'm going to stop the share for just a second. There, those gifts are loading. I had a past client that showed up and I went, oh, I wonder what, you know, she, she created a story. So I went in and I, I said, Hey, where are you going? It was like going somewhere warm. And she said, we're going to Mexico. I go, oh my gosh, that's amazing. Um, enjoy the heat, enjoy the warmth. How's the house? And she, and she, like, literally, our snaps went back and forth. It was so fun. I kind of had fun. Elise is, Elise is, tap, is typing. And so here's the short story, guys. I found out that they had a baby. I found out that um, the baby's name is Roman. I found out the baby's seven months old. I've now been invited. They were snapping me pictures of their new baby. I haven't talked to these people. We closed four years ago, four years ago. Now that now we're invited to go over and meet baby Roman to see what they've done to the house. And don't you know that as soon as I finished that little snap, I went on send out cards and I'm not going to show you the card, but I did, I did, do screenshots of the picture she sent because that's what I don't like about Snapchat is you lose stuff. I'm a visual person. So I, I did screenshot it, but I put those screenshots in the card that I sent back to them, congratulating them on their baby boy. I added the, um, the little giraffe. Let's see. Oh, sometimes on zoom things don't, let me just see if I click on bestsellers. Here we go. So here's the best sellers. Everybody loves the chocolate brownies, right? Farah and Ann? Oh yeah. Yes. Oh yeah. <laughs> um, the caramels. These are um, the blonde brownies are actually really good as well. Yes. And yeah. um, relative, they're kind of celebratory. You know, I don't think it does say birthday. It just says celebrating you. But here's this little jingles, the blue giraffe. And how easy was it for me to create that card at the giraffe, it was $20. Now, the impact that this little giraffe is going to have goes way beyond the price tag of $20. But what did we we talked about earlier in this call being um, the reach of influence. Yeah. Our reach of influence. It's ROI, return on investment. I'm not counting on that $20 giraffe going out to, to bring me anything except a more solid, stable relationship with Steph and Elise and hopefully go over to meet their little baby boy Roman in the near future. So gifting, um, I'm going to share with you a video and I hope you can hear this. So I sent a card recently to my friend, Steve Trezik. He's a, he's a big fit dude, um, trainer. And just the other day he sent me these little videos. And so hopefully you'll hear it. And it has arrived. Ooh. Look how exciting it is. It's <laughs> not my bus driver. We call that a multiplier. Bus driver on the bus. 
let's go. All right, there's that one. Then this came. It's like Christmas. Mmm. <laughs> You're the slowest opener I've ever experienced. <laughs> All right, then one more. He's just adorable. He is. He said, excuse me, what's this key for? <laughs> Aw. Okay, and then this picture. So, so, so I just want to, I wanted to share that with you because the impact that we have by sending cards and gifts expands more than what we really can fully understand. Um, and I wanted you to see that because I think it's important to know that, you know, when we pause and we, we create those opportunities to bless other people with um, our, our hearts, our kindness, our words, our gifts that we have within the system, um, it, it does have that reach of influence that we're all looking for in business. Um, some of my favorite new things, and Send Out Cards Gifting has amazing stuff, but mm -hmm. if I just click on See All with the card size gifts, you don't have to pay additional postage on these. Um, you, just, you just pay a dollar uh, plus whatever the gift cost itself is for putting them in the envelope. And so these are some really awesome things that you can. Um, act on your promptings, reach out, um, share. I, I love the sail away tokens. I just received um, one from my one of my good friend Joy recently, but these are just awesome little things. Um, cats and, and the dogs. So if you have pet lovers and they lose a pet, think about you know putting a picture of that pet on the front of a card and sending that with a little token. Um, with the with the dog or the cat token in there. So as you can Ew. see, there's tons. Yes, Ann. Explain those little cards. Cause I'm addicted to them. I know you mm -hmm. are too. Like the little believe in yourself cards and how random they are. They're so, so cute. Right. So so this is, for example. <laughs> these are so cool. So I'm going to stop the share and just show you. So these are like little, little cards that you get. So this one, yep. this one says an inspired life. So this is from my box and the inside, it says inside us, there's everything. We just have to look for it. And so there's little quotes, there's little things on the back where you can um, make notes about what that means to you. And so when we want to just bless somebody and, you know, give them, encouragement or praise or acknowledgement yeah. then sending those little cards are, are pretty darn cool so now we're going to jump into branding and um, when you brand your cards when they go out so here's examples I'm going to share some examples with you of heartfelt cards so here's a few heartfelt cards that I've received um, recently so I took my grandson over to a friend's and he drove this, he, he didn't drive it, Noah rode in the Lamborghini with my friend Robbie. And so I posted these pictures on social media and my friend Bonnie sent this card to me as a remember. So on the back, here's, here's Bonnie's um, branding on the back. Bonnie's a real estate agent out in the great state of California. So Look, this this came to me last summer. Guess where it still sits? Still sits on my desk. There's an idea. Um, Steve, who just I just showed you those videos with him and his son Joey. He sent me this card. He's just getting into send out cards, and that's me doing aerial yoga yeah, with a little frightened face. But this is a cool card. He he created for me, and then on the back, you know, Steve's known for saying, "Let's go." So cheers to a happy and healthy 2020, let's go. And there's a picture of Mr. Muscles, but he also put a picture of Steve and I on there. So when you think about branding, I want you to think outside the box. I'm gonna show you some examples. 
but think outside the box. Uh, sometimes the best branding is no branding. Like the big card I shared with you from my friend Alicia. She didn't brand the card. I know it's from Alicia. So it depends on the card. So I got this card from my friend Kyle. Kyle Sutton is a realtor in Pittsburgh. And if you follow Kyle on social media, he's always promoting his community, things that are happening in Pittsburgh. Yeah. But we did a Zoom call and, and he took our picture, he did a screenshot of the Zoom call. So um, these are kind words. These are kind words from a friend and a colleague. And I save this, this gives me energy. The words, the pictures you send out to people gives them energy. And you want them when they pick up a card that you send them to feel that energy of kindness, appreciation, celebration, love. Um, one of my past clients posted a picture on social media at Christmas time of her family. I, I put it on a, on a, a, a flat card and I sent it to her. And she posted on her wall that card, that picture in a frame. She says, you have now just entered into um, the cherished keepsake Christmas you know, memory. And they, she's gonna bring that out each year. She's the same one that I, I went over to her house one time and I said, does it bother you that I take your pictures off Facebook and put them on cards? And she says, Gail, all your cards go into our baby books. What comes out at graduation time, <laughs> right? Yep. When you're searching for those pictures and those things that, you know, we give a gift to people. When we, when we send them cards like this with pictures, it's a gift. People mm -hmm. don't print pictures anymore. Yep. So when, you, when we send them to them, it's, it's giving a gift of themselves back to themselves. So Ladies, do you have anything to add as far as before I share my screen and get into kind of the branding part of what send out cards can do for us? Well, one thing that comes to mind, if I can add this really quickly, and I did, did notice that a friend of ours um, on Facebook has just asked for help. Her son is in the military and he has been deployed. Mm -hmm. And um, it's a very, very big thing right now. And um, I had a friend who went to officer training school that I had only met online through Facebook, yet every week I sent her a card. And I ended up getting her token, one of her um, tokens, which in the Air Force is a really big deal. And it, it still brings tears to my eyes when I think about it. She is again in officer's training school this, this next eight, nine weeks. But keep very aware of the fact that there's men and women who are being deployed again and to other places. And um, what's more inspiring than just to tell one of our, our military people, um, we love you, thinking of you, praying for you. Um, you got this, no matter what. And um, so that's like, that's the front of my mind right now is that, you know, again, we're cycling back to, you don't even need to know them, just send them a card. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah. And I know Ellen just posted uh, in the chat that she was very touched by Jalissa's post about Darnell. And yes. I think, um, <laughs> and, and Issa's going, ladies, how can I get started? What's a good amount of money to start with? Okay, we're gonna get into that. And yeah. it's coming very, very soon. So hang in there, hang tight. Yep. Give us about five more minutes. I'm gonna <laughs> share my screen. <laughs> I'm gonna share back over and I just wanna share some of the branding um, opportunities and give you ideas of the branding. So this is our default branding. So when I go to send a card, um, this is the first thing that pops up, whether it's on the app on my phone or if I'm sitting at my desktop on my computer. And so as you can see, there's one, if, if it's more just about me or if I'm sending someone, there's one that just has me and sit standing out in front of our for sale sign. Um, I use this for sympathy. This is a sunset at our lake. And um, it just says, wishing you peace that passes understanding, Stephen Gale. <laughs> My husband's such a distraction. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> he just came in with, he's making sausage. He's making summer sausage. So would you like to show everybody sure. so you can get? <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
Wait, let me show Oh, boy. Nice. He's got to show off his, his summer sausage. So there you Very go. Very nice. Yeah. Save one for me, Steve. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's got to go, it's got to get room temperature and we can, uh, Okay. <laughs> He's so funny. He's so proud of himself. And, but that's hard work. There's no harder work than making sausage. But so back to like, think about, um, things that will bring peace and joy or mm -hmm. peace and comfort. And so this is just a, a back that I have that goes out for, um, sympathy this was that went on the back of all the holiday cards that we send out it just says you are treasured stephen gale um again as i scroll down um this one goes out a lot if i want to in in you know you are hella rad there's a card so you know <laughs> helping to inspire people so your custom branding is both business it's personal and um, it allows you to do what, uh, convey who you are and what you want to do. So we're going to go now to pricing because um, Issa needs to know how can she sign up. So when we're back here, pricing. Here's your options to get started with send out cards. You can be on a basic plan, but it doesn't have the relationship manager, which I think is so important for business owners to create that. Um, the enhanced allows you to have that relationship manager and pay a discount on the cards when you're sending them out. So um, you can you can read and see what the discount is. I'm going to focus on the card a day and the unlimited. The card a day plan is $37 a month. It's um, it includes 30 heartfelt cards. Now remember, the heartfelt card is defined as any card with unique heartfelt message and an immediate send date. I'm thinking of you today, I'm writing out a card and I'm clicking send. A system card is a, a single card to multiple recipients. A scheduled card that sends to more one or more recipients or a multiple touch campaign. So the heartfelt cards, you might start out with a card a day, if you're sending more than 30, 40, 50 cards a month, then you need to look at the unlimited. The unlimited includes postage, which is huge. Um, <laughs> yeah. So just think, and I like simple math. So 100 cards a month for $97. That includes postage. It's less than a dollar a card. And if you were had to go out and buy your own stamps, 100 cards would cost you $55. So that being said the cards in the unlimited if you're if you're going to get into the habit and use it robustly is what you need you can see that the a dollar 75 for system send cards um, on the unlimited so if you're creating the campaigns um, and you don't have the the, the system package then you will you will pay a dollar 75 per card plus postage which is still a really great price mm -hmm. Um, 30% discount on gifts. So the brownies go from either, you know, 550 for the brownies down to 389. And then the shipping, you get a discount on shipping on their top sellers on the 97. The system package, um, you're, you're pre-buying. It's like you're buying in bulk. People always ask me, can I buy in bulk? Yes, you can. Purchase the system package for $395, and that gives you 300 system cents throughout the course of 12 months. And what that equates to is $1.31 a card versus the $1.75 if you don't have the system package. So ideally, $97 add the system package is going to allow you to run your real estate business um, at ultimate uh, optimum speed new ultimate wasn't right so I'm gonna share with you now I'm gonna send this campaign and then we're gonna close out and I'll be able to answer some questions if you have them so this morning I was thinking how would I like to share with you so the January 2020 top 150 card so this is the campaign card that I created this morning and um, I'm going to just do a send order I'm going to select this card and I'll show it to you as it loads. I'm going to create. 
So it's creating my order and here's the card. So this is the front of the card. It just says, Happy New Year from your friends, Stephen Gale. And what I did was I, I added images of some of the properties that we worked with in 2019. And so loading them in, and here's the message. Dear first name, that's going to pull the first name in the contact manager. I dated the card, today's date. Happy New Year. As we enter into this next great decade, we want you to know how blessed we are to have your friendship. Our business continues to thrive because of your trust and referrals. You may recognize some of the properties. The pictures on this card represent many of the families we had the privilege to represent in 2019. Thank you for your continued trust. We are thankful for the mild winter here in Southwest Michigan. If this is the year buying or selling real estate makes sense for you, We'd like to be your resource. Stay warm and healthy. Spring will be here before we know it. We value you, Stephen Gale. Here's the back, here's the back of the card. Now, I'm gonna add the recipients. I've created groups. I have 32 groups in my, in my send out cards system. So when I look at those groups, my 150 top of mind and my BNI members, these are the groups that I want to send this card to. Click done, it's going to populate. 130, 83 recipients are going to receive this card. It says ready to send. I click here. So I want you to see this. I have the system package. So 183 cards, which would have cost over $180, are not $180. What I'm paying for is the shipping. 183 cards at 55 cents each is um, $100.65. I'm clicking send and congratulations, I made the world a better place. And because of your commitment to come on this webinar today, I made a commitment to myself to have something that I could show you. I use the system every single day. I send an average of eight cards every single day. I got an email this morning that 14 cards were being printed. Um, I got an invoice saying that $69 was um, charged to my account for the four or five gifts that I was able to send yesterday. But guess what? I didn't have to go out. I didn't have to go anywhere. All I had to do was be intentional mm -hmm. and use my system in a way that um, is able to enhance our, our business and our personal life. So um, I'm going to open it up. If, if Ann or Farah have anything you'd like to add to that, if there's any questions that we can answer, I'm, we'll be here for a, a few more minutes to be able to answer some of your questions. So I was timing you and it took you less than two minutes to send that card, Gail, to a hundred and some people. 83, That's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm sure it took you a little bit longer to create it, but it's a point and click kind of situation. And it so took you may, so two you minutes. Have, I love I love what you said about that because honestly, it, it does take intentional thought. You guys, send out cards is an amazing system, but unless you work it, it's not gonna work for you. You have to be intentional. I was thinking this morning, it's like, okay, what kind of card can I create and send? And actually, I, I don't know, Anne, if you remember Snowmageddon like eight or nine years ago, and yeah. there was a picture of, I did a card and I, I wanted to resend that to say, oh my gosh, aren't you glad that we're not having this kind of winter? And I couldn't find the card. So then it popped into my head, the template that we have in send out cards, and I could put nine houses on the front, I could put 12 yeah. houses on the inside, I could write a message, and I could click send. Here's where I think that so many people, um, they, they overthink it. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, oh, I don't know if I should say that. 183 people are going to get that card, including the 21 people that are featured on that card. If the 21 people that are featured on that card see their homes and yeah. remember the, what, you know, the, the, um, the, <laughs> I can't think of words. 
they, they remember how the transaction went and then they they go into work and someone says oh, i'm thinking about maybe buying or selling this year who did they just hear from right the yeah. realtor they just heard from their realtor and so it's our job to stay top of mind it's our job to implement knowledge without implementation will get you nowhere Hello. <laughs> yeah, you, have to, you have to implement. Get on the ninety-seven dollar a month plan. Commit to sending three heartfelt cards every single day. Look on social media. Look for people to celebrate. If you have over a thousand friends on social media, I guarantee you there's three people that are going to post something out of those thousand friends that deserve to hear from you. And the more they hear from you, the more often they hear from you the more they're going to remember, they know who you are. They know what you do. They know how to find you. They trust you. You just have to be top of mind when they're ready to act. Mm -hmm. And NAR statistics say that, you know, 85% of the realtors would work with their um, realtor if they remembered who they were or how to get a hold of yeah. them. Yeah. So if you're out, if you're creating, um, your business through open houses and and you're creating your business through transactions from people who you find now's the time to build that contact manager remember them over and over and over again it took us well i'm going to say three years 2008 well to 2011 being intentional in a down market relational three years eight cards a day 365 days a year to create a hundred percent referral based business and we've maintained that since 2012. there is there is a lot of joy in doing business through people who know like and trust you mm -hmm. and who, who find you so um are there any other questions You've got a ton of them in chat right now. Okay. Um, Denise says, so Gail, would you, oops, I'm going to go back up here. Um, Isa, do we need to upload it to um, the data into the system? Yes, you can import contacts and send out cards. If you export them in a CSV file, you can import them in. There is a template for you to use in there. So if I can just go over and show you in relationships, importing contacts, you can download a sample file. Click there, bring it up. You've got the headings on, on how you should import your um, relationships. So it'll just open up in Excel and you'll be able to, to, to do that. There you go. Crazy, crazy that, easy. Crazy easy. Mm -hmm. um, and it is a tax write-off. Gail, do you make those backs in Canva? Sometimes I do. The one that says you are treasured, Steve and Gail, I made in Canva. I have a fun thing. There is an app called, um, hang on, it's, it's to use, with Instagram pictures, because sometimes we get a little frustrated because we can't use Instagram pictures. It, it will do collages for you. And it is called, it is called layout. Wow. That's like groundbreaking. It's called layout. It's a free app. You can do, um, collages. I just did a nine collage so that it's loaded into one picture frame. And, um, it makes, throwing a bunch of pictures together, but using one picture frame in um, send out cards. Nice. And you can use your Instagram pictures, which, you know, they're not the easiest to go and grab sometimes. So awesome. called layout. Awesome. So uh, let's see, we, we had a, it just says, Sai, it cut your name off. Um, for system cards, a total of 300 cards a year or 300 at a time. What you do is you, you have access to 300 system cards for the price of 395. 
once you use those 300 cards for the full year, you can send as many system cards as you want for $1.31 plus, plus postage. So you, you're buying the access of having um, unlimited system sends for 12 months for $1.31. Plus postage on those, Gail? Plus postage. And here's the cool thing, you know, in the, in the USA, and I know people are listening all over the world, in the USA, um, our postage is 55 cents. In Canada, I believe it's like 89 cents. This works from Canada too. So if you're in Canada and you're looking at um, sending heartfelt cards, honestly, think about that, $97 a month, and your postage is included in Canada as well. Mm -hmm. So just wanted to throw that out there. Does the postcard um, send as a postcard without an envelope and is the postage le less? Yes, the postcard postage, I believe is 35 cents. Let me see if it says on here. <laughs> I just got one from Farah. <laughs> um, it's really nice, it's, there's, it's, it's coated. Mm -hmm. So the weather, the weather shouldn't bother it. Sometimes they get a little scruffy though. See that yep. little stuff yep. up there? And, and that's because they don't go in an envelope. And that could happen to any postcard that you get through the mail. Mm -hmm. um, what if you don't have their address? I just ask them, hey, I'd like to send you a card. Could I have your home mailing address? Um, sometimes they say, well, can I just give you my work? I'm like, that's where you want to receive mail, but are you going to work there forever? Think about <laughs> that. Some people sh switch. Um, so I just ask them. I had someone tell me, I asked them for their address and it was the other side of a, my, one of my transactions. And I said, I really like your, your address. It, she was the transaction coordinator and the realtor. And she said, well, do you want home or, or work? I said, either one's fine. She goes, well, I'll give you work and then it'll come to both of us. And I said, well, it's really yummy. So don't leave it in your box because it, it's a cubicle, situ you know, little box situation. She goes, well, then I'll wait outside the box and drool. And I go, yeah, because I was sending her brownies. But it was so funny. I go, you don't want to leave it in the box. <laughs> so you have to share it. Yeah. If you tell them you're sending something yummy or you're sending them a high five in the mail or you want to send a hug in the mail, they're going to give you their address because they're curious now as to what it is that you're going to send them. <laughs> Exactly. Mm -hmm. um, Denise says, do you put your branding on most cards or not? It just depends. I mean, I honestly, I probably 50, 50, 50% 50 of the time it's real estate branding and 50% of the time it's just lifestyle. It could be the sunset at my lake. Cause I kind of like it there. Yeah, and I want to share that with people <laughs> just a little, um, Okay, and we were getting a lot of questions about the system package. Um, so yes, you it's it's one system package per year, three hundred ninety five dollars. It that comes with three hundred cards. Anything you send over three hundred is a dollar thirty one plus the stamp. And I think one of the questions is, I think they think, do you have to send the three hundred all at once? It can be in tens. It can be in twenties. It can be in 13s. It could be, yeah, it could be the same card for two people. But your, your whole bulk is 300 for the year is what you paid for, if that helps answer that question. Okay, so um, I don't know if this is Ryan and, or Jackie, but Jackie, they said they have uh, an idea. So oh. I'm voting you to panelists so you can come on and share your little idea with us. Hey, it's oh, hi, guys. guys. <laughs> <laughs> you hear us okay? Yeah. Okay. So um, Ryan and I actually um, made friends with some local business owners, and we had 500 business cards printed that was a coupon for like a free scoop of ice cream or a free coffee or something like that. And so I had this really good idea that I have not implemented yet. Oh, here's what it looks like. Okay. So Cute. it says $5 off. I don't know if it shows up the correct way off of any drink. And it has our branding on it. So what I decided to do was create a JPEG of the coupon with the little dashes around it with the little scissors. Yeah. And you can drop that in the cards and do the 100 send or the 300 send. Mm -hmm. And you're, you can give them that instead of gift cards because then they have to cut it out and use it. So you have to be friends with the business owners so that when they turn them in, you know, but it's just a little something. 
I don't know. Yeah. Well, I well, think it's I, bad. I don't know. And and so <laughs> let's let's look at that for a second too. Another step you could take on the branding of those cards is co-brand yourself on the back with the business that you're promoting and then you know just bring this card in they don't even have to cut it out they could just bring this card in um or or, or make it so they rip it in, in half so they keep part of it so they remember you and then they turn the other part in and then yeah i think it's it's awesome jackie and ryan that you're doing that with 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 other business owners because it's in this day and age it's so important that we we partner together and we lift up and we build up each other and we help each other in business. Um, so let us know. I'm going to hold you accountable. You I know we're doing that it. card. We're doing it. I did have a quick, quick question. Um, basically what she does, the owner of the coffee shop, it says $5 off any drink. So if they get a drink that's 385, she writes 385 on the back. She staples the receipt to it. She saves them for me. Mm -hmm. And then she charges my QuickBooks account. So there's really no discount given. However, the ice cream shop guy, he gives us the two scoop bowl for $2. So for okay. everyone he collects, he, cho he only charges our card $2, but he charges us like once every three months as they're turned in. So and I, think, I think that's an amazing idea. And I'd love for you to like, really work on this and we'll share it over into the realtors business by referral with send out cards group another idea that i gave a business owner was um the local nurseries we have a plethora of them around here but the local nurseries um do they have like a 297 or a 397 plant that you could make a coupon for it's the same idea and then they can go in and get a flower on you um you know or a hanging basket even and then it's the same idea just charge me when you get to so many or i'll pay x amount um that kind of thing so it's yeah that helps promote our local businesses mm -hmm. super great idea awesome there's so much farah do you have anything in closing you'd like to share with the audience <laughs> well i you know these cards have been they're so important that i mean i'm surrounded by cards now they're behind me they're up here on the wall and so anytime i want to you know a, a pick me up or a reminder to send them is to look at the ones that i've received and remember how they made me feel um and so of course you know my kids run for the mailbox every day because i know i'm getting a card from probably one of the three of y'all um, and you know, and I get messages every day too. Thanks so much for the card. It's wonderful. It's perfect timing. It made me feel great. So it really has been, it's been a great, um, addition to my business and my life. So yeah. Thanks y'all. And any last words? You know, if all you ever do is send a card because you want to show kindness and appreciation, you will gain so much more than business. You'll gain, you'll gain friendships, you'll gain love, but you also have just changed the energy around just appreciating people and sending kindness. It's what Cody Bateman started this company for. So if that's all you ever do it for. It's the number one reason to send cards. And I'll close with um, a little promotion <laughs> for my friend Cody Bateman's book, The Power of Human Connection, how relationship marketing is transforming the way people succeed. And I love this because <laughs> he did write a story. This is a story that um, happened to us because we got into the habit of sending cards. Page 36, if those of you are listening to your books. Um, and I can, I have the, you can download this on Audible. It's awesome having Cody read it to you. You can go on Amazon and purchase it. And um, if you don't have it and you're on this webinar, live on the webinar and you don't have this book, private message me your address and I will send it to you. Yes. So that's your gift for being on the webinar today. If you don't have the book already, just message me your address and tell me a couple things that you learned that you're going to implement. And um, we will see you next time. So thanks everybody for being here. I appreciate it. I appreciate your time. I know it's valuable. Go out and make someone's day today. Take care. See y'all. Bye y'all.